And I already cut the tape off, and I have a little guide to tell um, about the turtles, I guess. I have some food, little baby turtle food. And then here's the live baby red-eared slider turtles. And when I open it up, I have these three little baby tiny turtles, about the size of a quarter. And they're going to go in my new 20 gallon that I made with the homemade turtle topper. And... They're all alive and happy and hopefully gonna like their new little cage. Let's go put them in. So here are the turtles right here. Take the um, little noodles out and there they are. And so this is just a little homemade cage top because none of the others would fit because of the turtle topper but it's just to be extra safe and um, I've been looking these over this one is the biggest ah. he has the best coloring and um, on his shell, he has a little deformity, I guess. It's hard to see, but there's another little overlap thing. I don't know what it's called. But he's the most active. And um, he has a spot on his head, on his forehead right there. So that's just a sort of tell a difference from the others. And so I'll just put them in the tank right now. Let me get the camera. So I'm going to put them in the tank right now. I don't have all the gravel in yet. Um, I just have a few rosies in here to um, occupy some space and then I'll feed them to all my um, frogs and all that so here's the second one this one's a little bit more shy I think it's the youngest it has the darkest show um, still some pretty nice coloring not as bright as the other one but um, still really nice and so it's time to put him in so here's the last one um he's still a little bit shy too um but he's pretty active oh have to hold on to him. Um, part of the bottom starting to fade a little bit, but I don't really know how to tell sexes yet. Um, if you know how, <laughs> tell me. And just put them in. And I already put some of the little turtle food that came with it in there so they can eat it. And an upgrade on the turtle topper is 
I've made, well, there's a little light right there. You take that off, and it's dark, but this folds up. I have hinges, and I have some green turtle carpet that I stapled down for them to not just be walking on wood. Um, I have a little rock in the corner and I had to redo the ramp. I just um, found a little hamster ramp at a pet store and bought it and put it there. Just one more time. They're really gentle, not biting at all. <laughs> trying to get through my fingers.